Hey guys, been doing the unboxing of the packaging of the SH figure figure arts. It's like one word um, action figure that is a, about six inches tall, five inches, something like that. Um, but this thing is articulated. The key with this one is that it is the Bandai version. Bandai is the what you're looking for because I accidentally got one that I thought was going to be this, but it was a knockoff, a bootleg copy. So let's get this opening up. And you guys can see the first of it because, it, as you can see, it is not opened yet. I picked this up on eBay. I bid on it. It cost me about 60 bucks. But I have a bootleg. Uh, feeling this is going to be worth it because the other ones are going for about 120. You know the ones that MSRP, it's about 120 bucks. Um, Bandai makes really good quality castings. I mean, down to like really super fine castings. And the pictures, the product pictures of this are incredible. First of all, let me before I pull this out. You really can't see much of what's inside because the black pearl is fogged up where the where the figure is just kind of poking out of there. Um, it does have Johnny Depp's likeness, and it does have the Disney logo, which is another important factor because it is authorized by Disney. In you in here, you get two um, clenched fist and two, four, six, eight other types of hands, two different types of comp compasses, compai, <laughs> and um, uh, the hat, two different faces, one looking to the left, one looking straight on, a rum bottle, a sword, uh, the baldric and the sword uh, grip, and the, from what I saw on the bootleg one, which is almost like they took this and molded it, molded it directly, um, the the sword scabbard can um the the hilt of the sword can pop off to make it look like it but it is not able to go inside this baldric so you get the scabbard that yep has a little fake hilt and the empty scabbard can be swinging while he's holding it because uh, you don't want to make it look like he has two swords and what's neat, which is one of my favorite parts about this thing, is that all the details from the costume are there, including the, uh, the plug barrel bayonet. Now, the plug barrel bayonet, unfortunately, is affixed to the belt, the giant snake belt, and it does kind of stick out. But you have a joint back here where the hair can, can uh, move and swivel. Head swivels around. Jacket is separate than the arms, but um, you can disassemble this thing and mo move, maneuver all different types of cool, funky poses. So many points of articulation with to the point where you can pretty much do a stop motion animation with this. Um, you know, the, that's the thing about Bandai. Bandai, I have a lot of Star Wars stuff and um, a Star Wars Bandai kits that you build and the paint job on it. Now, I don't know if you can see it with this from this video, but the likeness, let me see if I can get it to focus. The likeness of Johnny Depp is just incredible. Oh, come on, focus. That doesn't look like he's gonna focus. It's gonna focus. Not on this camera, actually. I'm using the front camera. Maybe if I flip it around. Yeah, let's see. Um, I don't know how to flip the camera around. Anyways, I'll do some other pictures, some other stills with this, but, um, the way that they painted everything 
is incredible. And it is very much like what they show in the, uh, in the pictures. Um, there's even a really interesting toe uh, pivot point where you can be in a almost like a ready to run position uh, so you can curl up the toe. So pretty neat. I would give this uh, sculpt and the accessories an A plus for, ra for ratings. Um, oh, another thing that I saw on here because I make the ring, the gold skull ring. Now you can't tell that it's a skull, but it the, on the right hand, right hand, right middle finger, uh, you actually can kind of tell that it looks like a skull. There's a little bit of detail on there, so yeah. Looks pretty cool. Anywho, um, there is my review. Um, I'll take some pictures of of this uh, set set up uh, and all its accessories, and maybe do a couple different poses and post it on the site, the forum, the Jack Sparrow cosplayers and impersonators forum. Thanks, guys.